hi everybody today I'm gonna to be doing a haul in the bathing garden I actually got my order in today and this was I don't even know when she reopened I can't even tell you the exact date that I ordered because um, she opens so sporadically and when she does I'm there I grab what I need and I'm out so let me do the samples first um, she sent me these cute little samples of these roses and they're in hearts and they smell divine I don't know the scent I think these are mint some kind of mint but they smell so good and then here's some other ones and I think these are just basically over pores that she has and these are in the same scent and they smell so good so let me get into what I got free. I got two clamshells free this time. The first one is green and sassy, and I would give you a description. I have them all on my phone, which is what I'm recording from, so unfortunately I can't. But this one is super pretty, as you can see, and it smells amazing. It has a peppermint, or not a peppermint, I'm sorry, a mint note to it and an herbal note. So it's kind of minty herbal and it smells super good and then I got Cheshire Cat so cute with the little kitty on it even though I don't like cats but this is from Alice in Wonderland and that's what it looks like it's got the little embellishment she always does her wax so pretty and this is two-toned and this one I think is like raspberries strawberries lemon just everything smells so good okay so now let's get into what I ordered the first one is blackberry jam lemon curd and this one is also again two-toned it's purple on the bottom and um, yellow on the top with purple um, embellishments on top as you can see oh this smells so good you get the blackberry and you get the lemon in there along with a bakery note and it smells delicious the next one I got was Marshmallow Frosted Mango Tangerine, or Tangerine. That's a mouthful. This one is also two-toned, and you really smell the tangerine right away. It hits you, but it's more of a subdued tangerine, and it's also a creamy tangerine. So this one, again, is two-toned. So you've got the orange on the one side, the white on the top with the orange sprinkles, Oh, it smells so good. I love tangerines. The next one I got was lavender and apples. And this is supposed to be an apple, but I think it melted in transition. It's been so hot here in Wisconsin. And this one is exactly what it says. It's apples and lavender. And it's to die for, but that's what it looks like. Then I got black velvet cake wanted to try something different I really 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 love um, red velvet cake and I wasn't sure what black velvet cake smelled like but basically it's just a lot of chocolate chocolate cake is what I smell and look at the embellishments it's so pretty it's brown on top red on the bottom so beautiful oh and it smells so good then I had to pick up this one. This one is called The Sweetest Thing. This is the very, very first scent of the sugar scrub that I got from her. And I live by this sugar scrub. This scent is awesome. For some reason, it reminds me of my grandmother. It's so good. Oh, it smells delicious. And it's got that cute little two-toned rose or heart on the front with little pink embellishments and... Um, everything's kind of going everywhere the next one is sweet Maddie and this one's a really pretty one with a ballerina on the front and it's got that beautiful purple kind of flower it's just your basic um, pure type of wax color and it's just a beautiful floral scent I can't really describe it it's just very pure and very beautiful floral mmm smells so good the next one is Juliet, and this one is beautiful too. It's just a very beautiful floral scent. Um, this one is more rose. I can definitely smell the rose. You can see the rose petals. It's just the same color all throughout, and it's 
It smells really good. I'm glad she came out with some floral scents because I've really been looking for some floral. The next one is Sleepy. And this one is just pink all around. And you've got the purple and the pink and the white little embellishments on the top. And this one is just like a kick your ass peppermint. Like it's the strongest peppermint that you could ever imagine. And this is basically what I melt before I go to bed at night. Um, it smells so good and so pepperminty. Next I got the Candy Queen. Or I'm sorry, Pink Candy Queen. And this one is just like a really light pink all throughout. And it's got silver embellishments, um, silver glitter on the top. Really, really pretty. I can't really describe what this smells like. It's almost like marshmallow meets girl. It's just, it's really, really pretty. And then the next one I got is strawberry cheesecake. Wanted to try the strawberry cheesecake and it smells so good. Oh my God. So you've got a rose in there. You've got the mixed um, white and pink, pinkish reddish color. Um, and then it's white on the bottom. It just smells so good. The cheesecake is on the bottom and the strawberry is on the top. So it is kind of mainly cheesecake just to let you guys know. And then I also got lemon curd and rose milk. This is to die for. I want to get this in like one of her mega clamshells. It is so good. It's rose mixed with lemon and it is amazing. And it is, whoops, it is so pretty. And it's the two-toned again. You've got that beautiful pink color with the beautiful yellow and then it mixed on top. These two colors, excuse me, I think it got wax up my nose. These two colors really do go well together in scent and looks. And then the last one I got was Honey Toffee. And I'm not really sold on this one. I just wanted to try it out because it was new and I wasn't sure. But I smell more honey than I do any toffee at all. Um... And I'm not much of a honey person. This may go into um, a round robin. But that's that. And it's kind of light. It's kind of light on scent also. So I don't know. Maybe I just need to let it cure. So that was my haul from the bathing garden. Please don't forget to check her out on Etsy. Remember, um, if she opens up and you guys see that everything goes lickety split, don't panic. Message her on Etsy and she will gladly come up with a list with you and make up an order for you so you get to try her items. Don't ever feel that if she sells out, oh my gosh, that's it. I'm done. I can't order. She is so nice. Her name is Shannon. This is the little card she gave me. She's got kids. I believe she's got boys, possibly girls too. I don't know. She's a busy woman, but the nicest woman, one of the nicest vendors I've ever met. So please don't forget to check her out. Um, the website is thebathinggarden.etsy.com. That's E-T-S-Y.com. And thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe and have a wonderful day. Bye guys.